Life is a journey filled with ups and downs, where finding motivation and inspiration becomes essential. For those who have faith in Jesus Christ and God, this quest is deeply rooted in their spiritual beliefs. Together, motivated by faith in Jesus and God, these forces create a fulfilling life, guiding us through life's twists and turns, leading us towards self-discovery and growth. In the video ahead, we'll explore how faith-based motivation and inspiration can be cultivated, from discovering purpose to nurturing resilience. Join us on this faith-filled journey, as we unlock the secrets to a life filled with motivation and inspiration, all under the loving guidance of Jesus and God. With faith as our compass, we embark on a transformative quest, making dreams a reality under their loving care. Psalm 73 verse 24 You guide me with your counsel, and afterward you will receive me to glory. Colossians 3 verse 12 Put on then, as God's chosen ones, holy and beloved, compassionate hearts, kindness, humility, meekness, and patience. Proverbs 14 verse 29 Whoever is slow to anger has great understanding, but he who has a hasty temper exalts folly. James 1 verse 19 Know this, my beloved brothers, let every person be quick to hear, slow to speak, slow to anger. 1 Thessalonians 5 verse 14 And we urge you, brothers, admonish the idle, Encourage the faint-hearted, help the weak, be patient with them all. Ecclesiastes 7 verse 8 Better is the end of a thing than its beginning, and the patient in spirit is better than the proud in spirit. Romans 2 verse 4 Or do you presume on the riches of his kindness and forbearance and patience, not knowing that God's kindness is meant to lead you to repentance? Philippians 4 verse 6 Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving let your requests be made known to God. 1 Thessalonians 5 verse 17 Pray without ceasing. Luke 6 verse 12 in these days he went out to the mountain to pray, and all night he continued in prayer to God. Matthew 6 verse 6 But when you pray, go into your room and shut the door and pray to your Father who is in secret. And your Father who sees in secret will reward you. 1 Timothy 2 verses 1 to 2 First of all, then, I urge that supplications, prayers, intercessions, and thanksgivings be made for all people, for kings and all who are in high positions, that we may lead a peaceful and quiet life, godly and dignified in every way. Psalm 119 verse 9 How can a young man keep his way pure? by guarding it according to your word. John 14 verse 15 If you love me, you will keep my commandments. 1 Samuel 15 verse 22 And Samuel said, Has the Lord as great delight in burnt offerings and sacrifices, as in obeying the voice of the Lord? Behold, to obey is better than sacrifice and to listen than the fat of rams. Romans 6 verse 16 Do you not know that if you present yourselves to anyone as obedient slaves, you are slaves of the one whom you obey, either of sin, which leads to death, or of obedience, which leads to righteousness? Deuteronomy 28 verse 1 and if you faithfully obey the voice of the Lord your God, being careful to do all his commandments that I command you today, the Lord your God will set you high above all the nations of the earth. 2 Chronicles 19 verse 6 And said to the judges, Consider what you do, for you judge not for man but for the Lord. 
He is with you in giving judgment. James 3 verse 1 Not many of you should become teachers, my brothers, for you know that we who teach will be judged with greater strictness. Galatians 6 verse 1 Brothers, if anyone is caught in any transgression, you who are spiritual should restore him in a spirit of gentleness. Keep watch on yourself, lest you too be tempted. Romans 14 verse 12 So then each of you us will give an account of himself to God. 2 Corinthians 5 verse 10 For we must all appear before the judgment seat of Christ, so that each one may receive what is due for what he has done in the body, whether good or evil. Ecclesiastes 12 verse 14 For God will bring every deed into judgment, with every secret thing, whether good or evil. 1 Peter 4 verse 5 But they will give account to him who is ready to judge the living and the dead. Hebrews 4 verse 13 And no creature is hidden from his sight, but all are naked and exposed to the eyes of him to whom we must give account. Proverbs 1 verse 7 The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. Fools despise wisdom and instruction. Proverbs 9 verse 10 The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, and the knowledge of the Holy One is insight. Psalm 111 verse 10 The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. All those who practice it have a good understanding. His praise endures forever. Isaiah 33 verse 6 And he will be the stability of your times, abundance of salvation, wisdom, and knowledge. The fear of the Lord is Zion's treasure. 1 Peter 5 verse 6 Humble yourselves, therefore, under the mighty hand of God, so that at the proper time he may exalt you. Psalm 51 verse 17 The sacrifices of God are a broken spirit, a broken and contrite heart, O God, you will not despise. Proverbs 22 verse 4 the reward for humility and fear of the Lord is riches and honor and life. Matthew 18 verse 4 Whoever humbles himself like this child is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven.